The company Shanghai Tianchu Jixin Semiconductor commonly known as Tianchu Jixin has announced its first 7 nanometers data center GPU, which is stated to compete with AMD and NVIDIA data center. This data center GPU is called Big Island or Bi GPU which has been tailored towards AI HPC applications and other industries that can benefit from utilizing a GPU. This chip has been under development since 2018 and the Tianchu Jixin has teased that this GPU can achieve FP16 performance up to 147 teraflops. Tianchu Jixin introduces its first 7 nanometers GPU, called the Big Island GPU, with comparable performance to AMD and NVIDIA data center GPUs. Tianchu Jixin's first 7 nanometers GPU offers over 24 billion transistors, similar to the number of resistors found in NVIDIA newest graphics cards the RTX 3090 and RTX 3080. Though the company did not reveal the foundry responsible for this the packaging and fin pitch suggests TSMC is the source of this. The GPU utilizes the RTX 3080 and RTX 3090 NVIDIA GA102 GPU, which features 28 billion transistors. When comparing the two Tianchu Jixin first GPU does feature 4 billion less but the possible performance derived from this GPU cannot be understated. The Big Island GPU is stated to be fabricated on 7 nanometers and 2.5D chip on wafer on substrate packaging with the details seemingly aligning with TSMC 7 nanometers node. This may mean that China is looking to utilize a domestic chip production technology. This idea is further encouraged by China looking to utilize domestic fabrication instead of relying on other countries for its computer components. Big Island GPU general performance has been kept mostly a secret but Tianxu Jixin has stated that this GPU can achieve an FP16 performance of up to 147 teraflops. For comparison in the data center GPU market, NVIDIA A100 and AMD Instinct MI100 can offer an FP16 performance of up to 77.97 and 184.6 teraflops respectively. This puts the Big Island GPU lands firmly between the performance provided by NVIDIA A100 and AMD Instinct MI100 GPU, while offering support for a variety of different floating point formations. The Big Island GPU has been developed for enterprise applications, like AI and other applications, not for standard desktop PC or gaming. While the GPU itself features a similar number of transistors compared to the GPU utilized in the RTX 3080 and RTX 3090, this GPU is missing various hardware to make it usable for gaming use inside of any desktop. Some of the missing hardware includes pixel processing units, texture units, and rendering outputs. This lack of required hardware means that while this GPU will offer fantastic performance in teraflops, it won't compete in the gaming hardware market. The development for the Big Island chip began back in 2018. The tape-out was finalized back in May 2020 and should currently be in mass production if Tianchu Jixin wasn't to achieve its goal of commercializing this chip in 2021. This rapid development shows Tianchu Jixin's dedication to getting this GPU to the current market as soon as possible, intending to commercialize the Big Island GPU within this year.